In this worksheet, you will redraw this bed twice its size using the divider tool. The divider transfers distances without having to use a scale to measure them. When you don't care about the numeric dimensions, the divider is a lot faster to use. First, you will want to draw light construction lines to measure and mark along. You don't want to ever just mark along blank space because you don't know if you're being accurate. So I've drawn these light construction lines and now I'll mark off the bed and then double that dimension. Then I'll mark off the length and double that. Now I'll go back and darken in these lines. You might want to draw all these lines light first and then go back and darken them in. So there's the outline. Now I need to put the detail in. So I'll mark off this distance. And that's where the turndown is. Notice again, I've drawn a light construction line. Construction lines help create the object, but they're not part of the object itself. This is a 45 degree angle, so I'll use my 45 degree triangle. And then I need to mark off where the top of the turndown is. And it's right there. Then I'll draw these lines. I'm going to eyeball the distance apart. And I'll go back and darken in all the construction lines. Now for the pillows, you can handle this a couple of ways. You can draw one rectangle and then delineate the two individual lines. You might want to start out by finding the center. See, there's the center. You connect corners and where they intersect is the center. And I can do the same thing here. So that's where the center of the pillows would be. And then I might want to mark this distance from here and this distance from here to finish it off and I will let you figure out how to do that.